Hello and welcome back to Lemmings 2 The Tribes with Simulacrum. Here we are, we're going to be playing um, all the tribe levels 5 and 6. And yep. Yeah. It's gonna be fun, it's gonna be a rather short experience. First one of those is take your best shot, we get 9 minutes and a lot of different tasks. We'll see how this one looks like soon enough. So, once again, um, a quite easy level. This is going to be entailing uh, one lemming going ahead, through this maze and into the igloo. The basic standard stuff, which has been going on for quite a few levels here. Uh, first of all, we go ahead and select a roper. This is the crucial moment. And, uh, then we just fail and just start again. Sometimes the angle is not so optimal when you fire from down, up to down. You need to be quite close to the edge, like, like this. They're still not firing anything, so... Let's see if that was good enough. That's good enough, they will be... Let's see if that guy goes there. No, it was not good enough, let's do it again. You can see some of the ridiculous problems which usually occur in these levels. Not in these levels, but if you have too small a space, now it's good enough because that guy will walk up. So, a fencer here. Next, we have only one jumper, so this is key. To use it exactly somewhere on the edge here, where the sloping uh, ends and the hard edge begins, and you jump over the obstacle. Uh, the rest is pretty simple you select the roper and just start making a path and uh, pausing so as not to fall in any hole or anything. Here as well, we go ahead for more ropers. And what we want to do here is actually take the upper path, because it's the optimum one, uh, as far as I have discovered. Next we use the bombs to get us deeper here, Let's see if everything goes right. We want to be getting at least here, and then one more bomb somewhere around the middle. Over here, so we can begin uh, to use a scoper. At least that's how I will do it. We do have uh, bazookas and mortars, so I think there are once again different solutions. This is one of them. We go as deep as we can to see where he goes. Uh, it's going to be somewhere there. Okay, he walks back, but that's no biggie. I don't even know why they gave us so many minutes, with 9 minutes in good level, that's uh, very easy, but I guess it's an easy tribe, it's an easy tribe. Oh there, so we have Forge Path ahead, we only used um, actually 4 ropers, next one is uh, once again this brutal part to get through here, but as always you just pause and check that the edge most lemming to the left is uh, facing um, the left also with his head. Then everything's cool. We pretty much only fast forward the rest of this. A very easy level, much like some of the basic levels from the original Lemmings. Very easy. And we have a lot of tasks remaining after doing everything we have to had to do. I'm still a bit stuffed in the so <clears throat> it's taking so long. Damn. So, next level. It's gonna be level six. A level 6 is rather similar in the fashion. Turn back, yeah, they gotta give you a small of a hint there. Turn back, we get plenty of stuff like three platformers, three throwers, blah, 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 blah. a tractor. Of course, we're gonna be using the tractor this time because we have one. But first, let's uh, survey the level. We are on a high mountain and we have to get down. This is not the true igloo, it doesn't have a flag. And we can go down here. And all the way here, where, where the igloo is. Uh, the way I'm gonna be doing this is using a, an attractor. Because it's a very good method always, so why not? Somewhere around here. And one lemming should be free to do his own thing. Next we're gonna be selecting a club basher. And letting him go down. The most crucial parts of this level are exactly here. When he has hit one time, select the jumper. And pause. And now when he's close enough and he's about to make another bash, he just jump. If he jumps over, that's a bit more problematic. 
Next we use the second club basher to start working our way to the left. Uh, here we can also fast forward, it's uh, nothing nothing big. You can just save everything to um, somewhere around here, just to get beyond the, the snowman here. Not that anyone is going to really be turning because they can't be turning to the right here. And this is where we need the three remaining platformers which we have. We can, we can begin early, it's not a biggie. And as always, wait for the clicks. Wait for the clicks and fast forward. If you don't want to look at him building the bridge. Okay, like this. That should be enough. And it is. Next we just go up here. Um, release the lemmings from the attractor. And there we have it. Everyone is in one big clump. Or actually a few big clumps, I think. Here's all the lemmings in one clump. But a ridiculously easy level when we have learned all the tools of the trade know how to do, how to turn lemmings, how to jump, all the all the basics, makes for a very easy level, very easy couple of levels actually. And here we see they go to the igloo. Oh yeah. That's good times. Good times. Six lemmings. <clears throat> What's the next level going to be? It's going to be slipping and sliding. Okay, slipping and sliding. Looks pretty cool. Gonna be in the next video, so see you guys then.